Hello, hope you're doing good. In this video, I will be showing you how to add LinkedIn logo in Canva resume. For example, you can see I'm on Canva right here and this is a resume template that I'll be using. The first thing you will need to do is download the LinkedIn logo. So to do this, you're going to open a new tab and you're going to go onto Google or whichever browser you're using. And you can just type in LinkedIn logo. Then from there, you could select images. After selecting images, the option that I'll be using is this one from free pick. So you're just going to simply right click and then tap on save image. After you have done that, you're going to go into Canva. Then you're going to go over to the left hand menu option and select uploads. Then you'll tap on upload files. And from here, we're just going to be selecting the logo that we have downloaded. Now, after downloading the logo, you don't want to just drag and place it on the page. Instead, what I recommend you do is tap on elements from the top left hand corner. Then after selecting elements, you're going to tap on search elements. And from here, you can just type in circle frame and you'll see the option circle frame right there. And you're going to be selecting the circle frame. After you have selected circle frame, you can minimize the size. So for example, I'm going to minimize the size so that it matches the different icons right here. And you can drag and place it wherever you want. After you have done that, all you'll need to do is tap on uploads. And then you'll drag and place the logo in that frame as you can see right here. Now after you have added the logo, let's say for example, you would like to make it clickable. So once they receive your resume, if they were to tap on the logo, it would redirect them to your LinkedIn page. All you'll need to do is open a new tab and you're going to go onto LinkedIn. So let me do that real quick. Once on LinkedIn, you'll see right here, I'm currently on LinkedIn. All I'll need to do is tap on my profile icon in the top right hand corner. Then you're going to tap on view profile. Then you can either choose to copy your URL right here or you can tap on pro public profile and URL and you could copy it from there. So I'm just going to copy this. Then you'll go back into Canva. Once in Canva, you're going to select the logo. Then you'll tap on the three dots. After tapping on the three dots from there, you will see the option to add link. So let me do that again. You'll select logo right there. Then you'll tap on the three dots and you'll tap on the link icon. You're going to paste in your link and link. Then you'll tap on done. So now if they were to tap on this icon, it will redirect them to your link and page. You could also add a text and make it clickable by tapping on text from the left hand menu option, then tapping on add text box, for example, sake. Then we could drag and place the text box right here. After you have done that, if it is a case that you'd like to type in your LinkedIn or anything at all that you'd like to type in related to LinkedIn right beside the icon, you could do that. Then select the link icon. And again, you could paste in your LinkedIn profile link right there then tap on done. Now that I've done that, if I were to tap on share in the top right hand corner and for example, select download, then all we'll need to do instead of downloading it as a PNG, you want to change that and you can either select PDF standard or PDF print. If you don't select one of the PDF options, your links will not be clickable. So for example, I'm going to be selecting PDF standard. After it has been downloaded, as you can see right here, just give it a few seconds to download. Once it has been downloaded, if you were to open it, so let's say we were to open it right now. Once on our resume, as you can see right here, if they were to tap on the link and icon, it is going to open up our link and profile, as you can see right there. So that's it. Hope you found this tutorial helpful and informative. If you did, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe.